okay now let's look at uh, the next problem okay now this is interesting to sort the elements of the array okay so now uh, now when we uh, when when the user enters the elements for the uh, array he may enter it in any order he may you know um, in 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 a, a, a random order now what we need to do is after accepting it we need to organize it in uh, uh, let's say ascending order or descending order but it has to be in uh, some order rather than in random order okay so uh, that's the objective so let's start okay now uh, we need to start with hash include io stream dot h hash include conio dot h hash include of io manip dot h okay then comes the opening brace and the closing brace okay now int a of 50 are standard one now instead of uh, you know typing it again and again what we can do is we can open an existing uh, file in which some code has already been written and copy paste it so let us say uh, we require from there to here till here if we take uh, this is the code for accepting the elements into the array okay so copy and we can say window close and then we say edit paste okay so now this is done now the the thing is we don't require largest and second largest right? that is related to some other problem but what we do require is apart from these variables we require a temporary variable and uh, another uh, loop uh, control variable okay all this remains the same no changes now here uh, here what we need to do is uh, uh, let's start with the actual sorting so for i is equal to uh, 0 okay uh, sorry i is equal to 1 i less than n and i plus plus okay then uh, in again one more loop uh, mm, because what we will be doing is uh, we will be taking one, uh, the largest element putting it in the uh, front and then uh, the next largest then the next largest then the next largest so uh, so that by the end of the uh, you know the both the loops we end up with an array which is in sorted order okay so j is equal to 0 j less than n minus i okay and j plus plus okay now uh, the block code block and now we check if if a of a of j if a of j is greater than a of j plus 1 okay now if a of j is greater than a of j plus 1 uh, that means uh, we need to swap it so temp is equal to so temporarily we store whatever is there in a of j into temp then now a of j becomes free to be uh, you know used we can overwrite the value of this so we overwrite it with a of j plus 1 okay 
and now uh, a of j plus 1 can be stored with the temp. Uh, if you remember, we had already done this uh, swapping business, exchanging the values using a using a variable, temporary variable and without using a temporary variable. Okay, so uh, we have completed this. Now, once both the loops get over, the array is in sorted order. So now we can display the result. The sorted elements are okay. Now for again, you see to go through the array, we have to set up a loop. So for i is equal to 0, i less than n and then i plus plus okay and then c out set width of 5 and then uh, a of i okay now that completes the whole thing and now get ch okay now let's run this program and see okay there are errors expression syntax what's that uh, where is the expression syntax let's make sure okay there it is okay see the problem is j is equal to is equal to i have made it whereas i should have made it as j is equal to zero okay okay yes how many elements let's say five let's say six three uh, six three seven four and eight three four six seven eight so whole thing has been sorted so now we save the save the program okay let's save it let's save it and name it as sort okay yes now that it has been sorted uh, sorry saved we can quit